Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to have another cooking one-on-one -on -one session and today I'm going to make my infamous pepper steak. So I'm gonna show you some of the products that I like to use to make my pepper steak. Um, I get these from Stater Brothers and they just, they are the beef chuck thin slice corn egg. And they are like the thin slice. So it's about two slices in here and it's about two slices in here. So I like to use those. Also, you're going to need one whole bell pepper and one whole onion and a half. Um, I slice them, you could chop them, but I like them sliced. I like my veggies. So I'm just going to leave them just like that. The seasoning I'm going to use is garlic salt, seasoning salt, garlic powder, onion powder and a little bit of cayenne pepper as well as black pepper and then i'm also going to smother it with brown gravy so let's get started okay i already rinsed off the meat and i placed in this large rectangular glass pan so now i'm going to season the meat and i'm only going to season one side because the meat is pretty thin and you don't want it to be salty. This recipe is real simple. I love to cook this recipe and I usually cook um, rice and some corn with it or some greens and some mashed potatoes. So tonight I'm gonna make um, so just some plain white rice and some corn. This recipe literally takes about, mm, from start to finish, I will say about 45 minutes because the meat cooks pretty fast because it is very thin. Okay, so a little bit of cayenne pepper. And so now we're going to put our veggies on top. And like I said, you could cut your veggies smaller than this, but I like a little bite to my veggies. So I like to leave them kind of chunky and rustic. Mm -hmm. Just like that. And so now I'm gonna get a little bit of water. And place it in the pan. Just like that. And then we just place it in the oven. Okay guys, this is what it looks like when it comes out of the oven. So now I am going to pour the gravy on top of the steak and put it back in the oven for at least 15 more minutes. I cooked this for about 30 minutes on 340 degrees. So now I'm going to pour the gravy on top.
I use packaged gravy, but if you know how to make homemade gravy, then you're more than welcome to do that. So I'm going to put it back in the oven for about 20 minutes, 20, 15 to 20 minutes and let all of the gravy marinate with the onions, the bell pepper and the steak. And I'm going to cover it with some foil. So I will come back to show you the finished product. Okay, that is my finished meal. My pepper steak, rice with gravy with a couple of bell pepper and onion on top, and some corn. So I am about to get my grub on, so I will see you guys in my next cooking 101 video. Talk to you guys soon. Bye.